I think that effective time management and getting things done really comes down to what type of schedule you keep. So if you're um, a person that's in a lot of meetings all day, you probably have maybe 20 minutes or a 15 minute buffer in between meetings. I like to think that a 15 minute or a 20 minute block can be just as effective or more effective than a two hour time block. I call it micro tasking. So multitasking has been one of these things where everybody wants to multitask. And here's the problem is that everyone starts projects that they don't finish. And it's because you have the world's longest to-do list. And so my goal every day is to try and do three to five things per day related to my business. And that number is so low that I end up doing more. But I feel like at least if I can hit the three things on my list and I can set up like three little 20-minute blocks, I'm good. And usually those blocks are like, if I'm driving to a meeting in an Uber, I'm in the back, I can work. Or, you know, I might go outside for a walk and think and talk. I think it's, it's about what creates, you know, movement for you. Some people are really productive when they go to the gym. You know, I've, um, I've seen people do that. You know, they're riding and when they're sitting on the bike. But it, it's a short, defined period of time. Instead of setting this goal for yourself, it's like saying you're going to go to the gym on Monday. You know, Monday mornings historically for anybody are busy. So the idea that you're going to, you might mess up and then you won't do it and then you give up. I mean, I started by just agreeing to do three things a day. And then I kind of grew from there. And now I have these blocks of time scheduled. I mean, I have around 20 minutes every other day just to think about like whatever. And it just says think. And sometimes that thinking has led to writing. Sometimes it's led me to remember that I was supposed to reach out to someone six months ago that I didn't. I mean, and I don't think I, I challenge a lot of people to do that because I don't think people spend time to think because we're so busy. And the busy doesn't always equate to what we're trying to do. Obviously, we're all trying to, to get to a goal, but busy doesn't always mean that you're actually completing work. And so scheduling time to think and really thinking in smaller moments throughout the day as opposed to these big time blocks really gets it done for